because I know I couldn't make my drink for our episode of Triple Q today without having a drink to help me get through the time that I would take to make the drink. It's really not that long. I'm probably going to be double fisting for a hot minute. Oh well. I took a long weekend. This is what long weekends are for. Well, I guess we had better start making our second drink now that we are prepared to make our second drink with our first drink, like a hobbit with alcohol. Today we are making an amaretto sour here on Triple Q. It's going to be freaking delicious. It's a very classy drink. It's a sweet drink. It's yummy. I would call it a specialty of mine. It's revered in many circles. You may not like it if you don't like egg whites in your drinks. But if you don't like egg whites in your drink, you're going to have to get over it. It's really good, and it's not bad for you. I got this fly. But we're making an amaretto sour because it's refreshing, it's summery, it's sweet, it's delicious, and I wanted one. Do I need any other reasons? No, I don't. So I guess this is, we're doing it now. So first, we're going to add our amaretto. As you can see, I'm low, and I knew that I had better make one on film before I ran out, because, you know, who knows when I will find the will to go get more in the times that we're living in. So, we're going to do these. Now we're going to do two of these. This is lemon juice. So we have amaretto. Please don't I have said poor person amaretto, disarano, disarno, I don't know how you say it because as I said, poor person amaretto, but disar, nah, 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 is the best kind and you should use it. Then we're going to do two of these. And then we're going to do one simple syrup. this in a long time, but I'm pretty sure that's how you do it. I'll tell you if it's too sweet or not. Like always here on Triple K, I don't actually follow my recipes while I'm making it here in the footage. I like to fly by the seat of my pants. So I want to be as surprised as you are. No, really, my recipes that I shared in the description are good. I just don't follow them when I make it. Sorry about it. But a lot of my techniques are legit, so there. But then I have two egg whites right here, no yolks, just whites, separated. Here we go. Luke. I'm gonna put the lid on my shaker that already had was like three quarters full of ice, very full of ice, because we want it to be cold. So I'm gonna take my towel here, because we don't want our hands to freeze to our shaker. Cause it's unpleasant, it feels bad, don't do it. And we're gonna shake. Needs lots of shaking. Cause we're waiting for the mixture to get frosty on the outside and this one's just gathering condensation. It might just be too hot in here. Ooh, there's some like nice mist coming off it. Frost, I don't know. But we're gonna make sure we leave our lid on filter then I look at how nice and frothy it is that's exactly what we want we want the nice very light frothy effect that the egg white gives us nice little fizz this is my beautiful amaretto sour probably should back up because I'm probably too close this is my perfect amaretto sour it's beautiful it's frothy the right texture. I would have garnished with an orange or a cherry, but I didn't have any oranges and I couldn't open the cherry jar because Billy wasn't here and it was like, it was like Fort Knox up in that cherry jar. Some, some hardcore bullshit. So I guess 
Now we're just gonna drink it without any garnishes, but use garnish if you're not mean. Don't have a nice strong man help you open the damn cherry jar. I'm very put out about this whole cherry situation. But, oh well, still got an amaretto sour. What does he have? He doesn't have an amaretto sour because he's not here. Mmm. Oh, it's so good. Mmm. This is one of my favorites. I always forget how much I like them because they're just so light. They're sweet. Um, so I think I would have gone with either the one amount of syrup or the one and a half. Either way, I think I would have been okay. This is pretty yummy. It's very frothy. I think I think when it's sweeter, it really accents that frothiness. Mm. Like you really get those like notes of like almond and cherry and it's tasty. But yeah, like 10 out of 10 would recommend. This is one of my favorites. Make it. It's yummy. So this was like a short video, like a really short one because it's like a super easy drink that anyone can make if you have amaretto and eggs and lemon juice and simple syrup, which you can always make simple syrup. So if you have sugar and water, sorry, that got aggressive, but you can make an amaretto sour. So I guess with that, quarantine, stay safe, wear your masks. Uh, oh yeah, like and subscribe. Yeah, yeah, like and subscribe. And I guess we'll do this again in two weeks.